busy day of games. Before we get to that, we're paused 10 seconds so stations can identify themselves in the Kings radio network. Let's go! You're listening to Sports 1140 KHCK, HCK AM and HC1 Sacramento, KYMX HC2 Sacramento, and live on the radio.com app. All right, let's start with the finals that tell the story of today's game, for uh, today's kind of situation. We begin with the Suns and the Spurs. The Suns did win 123-121. They really didn't play their guys, but Etuan Moore hit a game winner. They now know they wait on tonight's game. They will either be the one seed or the two seed in the West, depending on what the Jazz do here with the Kings. Next, let's go to the Celtics and the Knicks. Here's Bullock with the Jag. Randall against Parker. Nice to the lane left side. Steps, kicks, Bullock the fake. Pull up from two is good. Off the dribble from 20 feet away. The Knicks lead by three. All right, then later on, ex-King Jabari Parker with a chance. Inbounds to Parker. Four seconds. Pull up three over Noel. Short. It's loose. Burks with the rebound. One second to go, and that is it. The New York Knicks, a 96-92 win over Boston. And how does this sound? Game one at Madison Square Garden. It's coming up next week. I know you like the sound of that, HT. <laughs> They're going to be the four seed. They will take on Atlanta. It's locked in. Oh, man. I know Spike Lee is <laughs> jumping out of his seat right now. His New York Knickerbockers are relevant once again. That is awesome. What a great year for them. And so that loss for the Celtics say more what they're going to be. They're going to be the seventh seed playing in that playing game against number eight because that's involving uh, the Hornets and the Wizards. Let's go there next with uh, Rozier with a putback. Ball to his right. Ball the mid-range floater. No. Rozier. Putback rebound for two. Terry Rozier. 22. Surging in front of the Hornets. All right. Then for the Wizards, Beal would put him up. Beal. And up on Zeller. Rozier. Defending in the post, the drive, the lay-in. Beal gets it to go. 23 for Bradley Beal. 11 for him in the fourth quarter. Hornets trailing by one. All right, so we come all the way down to the end, and Rozier with a chance. They go to Zeller. Flips to Rozier. Let's the three go off the heel. And the Wizards win it. They come back from down 11 to start the fourth quarter. And take a 115 to 110 victory. The Wizards will be the eighth seed. And Buzz City is going to have to visit the Indiana Pacers on Tuesday. Yeah, in the playing game, the Hornets will be 10 because they've lost five in a row. But Henry, the Wizards, they jumped all the way up to number eight. They will play Boston in the first of the playing games. West, uh, Russell Westbrook with another triple double. Wizards are finishing hot. Right. You know, you got Russell and Bradley Bill, man, that's starting to figure things out. Got the complimentary guys kicking in. When you have two guys of that magnitude, yeah, you can win some basketball games. For sure. Also, today, the Sixers, they didn't have to play anybody. They've already secured the one seed. Tyrese Maxey helped them out with 30 points. They got the one seed beating the Magic. You also have the Rockets and the Hawks. The Hawks won 124-95. The Rockets had the worst record in the league, of the best lottery odds. Next up, we'll take you to the Grizzlies and the Warriors. Here's Steph. 10 on the shot clock. Curry pressured by Jackson. Draymond gets it. Curry goes back door t- to a three. Look, it's good. Left side. Curry, arms up in the air, says, yeah, that's what I like to do. 11-0 run for the Warriors. Tim Roy on the Warriors Radio Network. Warriors win 113-101. The Grizzlies will host number 10, San Antonio. The Warriors are in. We already knew that. But Steph Curry, HD becomes the oldest scoring champ since MJ as he wins the scoring title. And Jason, I will tell you what. Steph Curry is making a hell of a count for MVP because what he's done this second half of the season, I mean, has been astronomical, keeping the Warriors in the hunt. All right, we also had, let's see, the Nets getting their guys back. They're trying to secure the number two seed. Here's KD. Moves it across to the right side to Griffin. Hands back to Durant. KD, out of the right wing, picked up by Allen. One-on-one, out of the right side. Pulls up, three on the way. Good for Kevin Durant. Cannot miss. Eight for eight from the floor. 23 points, 10 assists, six rebounds. Nets a 20-point lead. And then also the uh, Pacers ended up beating the Raptors 125 to 113. Our score here at 64-49, Utah with the lead over Sacramento. We'll come back with more.